Hey there fellow travelers, Mark here with Walters World and today we're in San Antonio, Texas on the Mission Trail and today we have for you our five tips for visiting San Antonio. And my first tip for you is visit the San Antonio missions when you are here. It is the most important sites or set of sites to see in San Antonio, the UNESCO World Heritage Sites and you have you know the churches that are there, these are working churches when you go there so make sure you donate to help them out but there's all these these missions along the way. The Espada you can see, San Jose, San Juan, things like that. There's a bunch of them out there to take in and so it is, really is a beautiful beautiful architecture experience but also you see how some of the people were living during the time when they were built so you can see where the homes are built into the walls and things like that and it is a really cool thing to check out. Now my second tip for you has to do about the Alamo. I mean we have to remember the Alamo when we're in San Antonio but what you should know is the Alamo is not as big as it once was okay. So you have the main building that you see in all the pictures and what's cool is there's actually the history shop in the back kind of that you can go see that actually has some really really good um, artifacts from there and what's cool is they're now starting to plan to build a brand new museum and redo it all but it is still good, cool to see even if they haven't redone it yet it is well worth checking out. So the third thing you gotta do when you are here is of course head to the river walk. And the thing is, it's really cool about San Antonio, the river, the San Antonio River, that's where the missions are on, goes to the center of town and you have the north end, the center end, and the, the south end. And what's cool is, each section has a kind of own vibe to go see. So River North or the Pearl, that's where the museums are you want to go see, the nice bars, the nice shops, the nice restaurants, that's on the north side. And then you have the center part, which is a kind of the tourist area. So you have the, the Market Square that's there, the San Fernando Church you can go to, which is cool because Tuesdays, Fridays, I think Saturdays and Sundays in the evening, they actually have a light show on the side of the church, which is really cool. Um, and then you have the south part of San Antonio River or South Town or Lone Star. Or, there's tons of different names for it just know the King William Street the King William area there's a lot of really cool architecture to check out when you are there so you do have that and what's cool about the South Bar is that's also the heart of the art district so you can go to the Blue Star Art Complex there's some bars there but if you go north from there and, and not just the north but you go to the south side as well to see other art galleries so it's kind of a cool kind of center place if you're looking for a place to go and branch out from now my fourth tip for San Antonio is my favorite part of San Antonio and that is having a puffy taco look they take the tortilla it's like reverse fried tortilla and they put the taco stuff in it and you eat that and there's a lot of places you can get it but Henry's is my friend's favorite one she's taken to me to a lot we've always enjoyed but you can get it at lots of places you're gonna have great Tex-Mex when you're here don't worry oh the Riverwalk Tex-Mex there's so many tourists that come here that's not as good as it used to be so you can get good Tex-Mex pretty much anywhere in the city don't think the Riverwalk is the end-all be-all of Tex-Mex or puffy tacos and stuff like that but you'll be fine there but go out and explore and have the puffy tacos and then my fifth little thing to do is when you do come here come with friends this is a fun place to go there's lots of conferences and parties and festivals and stuff like that to enjoy but when you come here go to an ice house. No, it's not a place where they have ice. It's not one of those ice hotels. It's just an outdoor bar, basically. And you go there, you sit there with your buddies, you're drinking some cans of beers, just shooting the breeze, having a good time, and talking about how great San Antonio is. So those are my five tips for San Antonio. I, I guess an extra one is, if you're coming here, park your car at the hotel and just Uber around town because parking is a pain throughout the city and the driving and stuff. And actually, things are pretty close, so the Uber rides aren't really that expensive, so you'll be fine with that. Anyway, if you like that, we've got the don'ts of visiting Texas, things you need to eat when you are in Texas, and so much more on our website at waltersworld.com. We're also on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, Twitter, and we really appreciate your likes, subscriptions, and we put out travel videos like this every Wednesday and Saturday. Bye from San Antonio.